Hi, we're Jason and Tracy Elliott. We've been attending St. Augustine for just over two years now. Um, I'm a professor at the University of Central Oklahoma. I teach management, leadership, ethics. And I stay home and take care of the house and we have a goat farm as well. The first time we ever came to St. Augustine, Sarah Emily met us at the door. And she not only recognized that we were new, but it made us feel really welcome, but she made us feel very comfortable being in a new environment and showed us around the church and all. We came to St. Augustine because we were looking for a fully affirming church. And not only did we find that, but we found a richness and diversity in cultures that we didn't really know we were missing until we had it. And so I'd say we very strongly have a connection to the mission statement and that we were personally enthusiastically welcomed see that all the time, but we definitely see a uh, commitment to the unity of all people every Sunday that we're there. So I would say that for us, the hopes and dreams for St. Augustine is that, like the story of the mustard seed, uh, we see in St. Augustine this amazing place that in a disruptive world that is full of tension, what God's kingdom here on earth could be. It's diverse it, in all types of diversity. It is truly living out the middle way uh, of the Episcopal Church. And if that mustard seed could grow and could influence the greater community and continue to influence the greater community as it already has, I think we would have a better city, a better state, if everyone looked at the world in the same way that St. Augustine is living that into its environment right now. I think God is actively at work in our church every single day as we continue to influence the communities that we're in. But particularly on Sunday mornings, we are blown away by uh, the uniqueness of the worship and that every Sunday it is something different and every Sunday it, it brings something to uh, the word that is impactful and we both are influenced by music by visuals by what we hear by what we read and it is so thoughtful and planned that it all connects such that all of our senses are impacted and we can truly feel God at work We give because St. Augustine gives, and we give of uh, our time, we give our money, and we give our talents because that's exactly what St. Augustine does.